वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम टू डैश टेन सो स्टेटमेंट इज द कॉर्नर ऑफ अ स्क्वेयर प्लेट्स आर गिवन डिस्प्लेसमेंट इंडिकेटेड डिटरमाइन द शेयरिंग स्ट्रेन अलॉन्ग द एज ऑफ प्लेट ए एन बी सो यू कैन सी इनिशियली दिस इज द स्क्वेयर प्लेट ए बी सी डी ईच हैविंग ऑफ एंगल ऑफ नाइन्टी डिग्री क्लियर एन देयर डिसप्लेसमेंट आर नाउ इंडिकेटेड बाई दिस डॉटेड लाइन क्लियर so what we have to find the shear strain along the edge of point a and point b so shear strain means uh, shear strain means change uh, shear strain means change in the angle change in angle so we will find that so how you will find that so let's start with the solution now you can see initially this angle is 90 degree and this point this edge is displacement displaced like this so dotted so initially if i draw the some portion fourth portion of this square plate so it will be like this so this is your point a this is your point b now you can see from this point till this point the distance is 10 inch so this is 10 inch from this point till point a this distance is uh initial this distance is this one so which is 10 inch so this is your 10 inch now point a is displaced to this point clear i will draw it using dotted line and this point b is reached to this new point and we will join them by using a dotted line clear and this reduction is 0.3 inch while this increase is this increase is 0.2 inch also this angle which was initially if we t if we take this angle so this is 90 divided by 2 which is 45 so you have to find this angle uh, this will in increase you will find this angle theta dash this is the angle or you can see that if i take the whole so this will be initially this was 90 so you have to find this theta dash so here this angle will be equal to theta dash divided by 2 so how you will find so first uh, you can see this is the theta by 2 so theta by 2 is equal to if you take tangent of theta dash by 2 so that will be equal to we have a new triangle this one i will show you this is the right angle triangle so from here tangent of theta by 2 is equal to perpendic uh, perpendicular which will be this one and base will be this one so this is 10 minus 0.3 which is 9.7 and this one will be equal to 10.2 inch so tangent of theta is equal to theta by 2 will be equal to uh 9.7 divided by 10.2 so from here you will get 10 theta by 2 is equal to 10 inverse 9.7 divided by 10.2 so you will get this theta dash divided by 2 will be equal to 43.561 degree and if you get theta So theta is equal to two multiplied by forty three point five six one degree. Okay, so this is in degree. So what we have to convert in radians? So we know that two pi radian is equal to three sixty degree. So one degree is equal to two pi radian over three sixty. So you have to multiply this theta with two into Forty three point five six one degree multiplied by two pi over three sixty radian, 
and you will get this theta dash will be equal to um, 1.52056 radian now this is the including this is the new angle and we know that sharing strain sharing strain at point a net is equal to pi by 2 minus this new angle which is 152056 radian and that will be equal to 0 0.0502 radian this will be your sharing stress sharing strain at point a because initially the angle was 90 this is 90 which is 90 degree is equal to pi by 2 and now the angle is reduce uh, angle is reduce so definitely this angle is 90 minus this angle theta dash so you will get the sharing stress sharing strain now we will apply the same condition over point b so you can see initially this angle was theta uh, we will represent it by using another terminology let this initial angle was phi clear now this new angle this which is the reduce one which is the uh, sorry what if we see that there is reduction in angle but this is now if this is reduced so this will enhance this angle which is phi dash so phi dash is equal to i will write it if we take tangent of phi dash over 2 we will take this half of the angle i will show you this is your phi dash over 2 so we have a right angle triangle over here so this will be equal to perpendicular and perpendicular is this one which is 10.2 while its its base is equal to 9.7 so perpendicular is 10.2 divided by 9.7 and you will get phi over 2 is equal to tangent inverse 10.2 divided by 9.7 so from here you will get angle is 46.439 degree means the angle is increasing okay now phi dash will be equal to 2 multiplied by 46.439 degree and what if you convert it into radian so 2 into 46.439 multiply by 2 pi over 360 degree uh, sorry 360 radian so you will get phi dash in radian is 1.62104 radian now this is the new angle and we know that sharing stress at point b that is net is equal to pi by 2 minus phi dash so pi by 2 minus 1.62104 radian will give you minus 0 0.0502 radian sharing strain at point b so it means that it is decreasing because initially the angle was 90 degree now it, the angle is increased so definitely there will be a, a negative value which is the shear strain at point b I hope you have enjoyed this video again if you are new to my channel then subscribe it and keep watching thank you